end. It make you feel like it's just me and God. My, my, my. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, everybody. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God is good. He is our Lord and Savior. I honor him today. Hallelujah. I want to give you honor to uh, my pastor friend, my, my brother, Pastor Farmer. My sister co pastor. You can't go around thinking you don't have an enemy. 
We in spiritual warfare. Amen. Ooh, we have an enemy. Yeah. Satan hates you. Jesus. That's right. Come That's on. Right. He don't like you. That's yeah. Right. Come on. He is the hater of all haters. You think you got haters here on this earth? <laughs> if you don't have one hater on this earth, you got the hater. Come of on all now. Haters. Come on yeah. now. Yes. 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 I heard somebody say, if you don't have haters, then 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 you you might not be that important. But guess what? We important because we we got the hate of all haters. Amen. Right? Amen. Amen. So we somebody, yeah. and he know it. Yeah. He know it. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. 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 He is an adversary. He seeks around, roaring like a lion, mm -hmm. seeking whom he may devour. That's his job. That's all he does. Trying he up all day. he don't sleep. No. He up all day. Trying to figure out how I'm gonna get you to trip up and fall. Mm -hmm. How I'm gonna get you to turn away from God. Mm -hmm. He hates you that much. Mm -hmm. 24 7. Mm -hmm. 365 days a year. Mm -hmm. Holidays. Mm -hmm. Weekends. Yes, right. yes, yes. None. If it was a, a, a 366 days, he'd do that one too. <laughs> we got the leap year thing, he on that one. <laughs> he on that. He, on that. Yeah. he don't yeah. like us. Anything that's pertaining to God, he hates. Yes. Amen. You have to know that. There was a survey I, I read in, in my in my research. There was a survey back in 2008 that 60% of Christians don't believe there's a devil. Hey. My Lord. Hey. That's in 2008. Hey. I can imagine now. Because hey. times are worse. Mm -hmm. Things are are, are, are are even more chaotic in the world. So that number probably up. And that's sad. That's Christians. Yeah. Yeah. There's yeah. people walking around praising God, loving God. They believe it's a heaven. They don't believe it's a hell. <laughs> and they don't use the devil that can put you there. <laughs> you or the devil don't put you there. You put yourself there, amen. Yeah. That's right. That's right. <laughs> but it's ama it amazes me how we can believe in heaven. But we don't believe in hell. All right. It amazes me that we can go around like we are in charge and we don't have any consequences to what we do. Right? Like we don't have an enemy. Mm -hmm. Verse 8 says, be sober, be vigilant. Well, what does sober mean? I'm glad you had. <laughs> <laughs> sober means to abstain from wine, to be calm and collected in the spirit. In other words, have a clear head. Yes, yes. Have a clear head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, is it? I know everybody here wasn't born saved. Come on. Hey Amen. Raise your hand if you was born saved. Okay. <laughs> I remember. I remember those days. Uh oh. Uh huh. When I have a clear head. <laughs> and I was on uh, much wine <laughs> and, and juice. You know. Yeah. I remember them days in the club where. I remember the days in a club where you danced with a young lady and you juiced up. Uh -huh, your, your, your head ain't clear. But we walk around and say, oh, I, oh my head right. No, I ain't. Oh, I'm nice. No, you're not. Not really. Not really. You walk around the club, you see this young lady, she looking real good. But you juiced up. You with her all night, you're dancing, you exchange numbers with her, you're making, you're making provisions for your flesh later on. And then suddenly they say, last call for alcohol, and you go get your last drink, you have one more dance. And then they cut them house lights on. <laughs> and you done already told her, yeah, we're going to go here, here, and do this, and do that, and blah, blah, blah. Then they turn them house lights on. Yeah. And then you see the roaring lion. <laughs> trying to devour you. Hey. It's important. Very, very important. Yeah. To have a sober mind. Very, very important. That's just one example. I like to have fun, y'all. Yeah. That's just me. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm, I'm serious about his word. Yeah. Uh -huh. But I'm going to give it to you. The way he gave it to the way I do it. Now, amen. 
I agree with that in the back, you know? Eventually, <laughs> it says to keep awake, to give strict attention to. I like, that song was kind of like saying that, right? Uh-huh. Who yes, giving attention to, yeah. Yes, Vigilant, to be watchful. Now, I was a mil happy veteran, to be Veterans Day, there any soldiers in the house? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a veteran. Amen. So I'm gonna give you this, uh, this military example now, of being vigilant. Now, you got a military, right? You got soldiers in wartime, because we're in spiritual warfare. Yes, you got that are. right. Yes, we are. We're in the army of the Lord. Uh -huh. So it's befitting that I use this example. But in the natural, you have soldiers in the army at wartime. It's important that they be watchful. Because, mm -hmm. yeah, they do have an enemy themselves. Mm -hmm. And one thing about the enemy is he does not come to, he doesn't attack the way you expect him to. That's right. That's mm -hmm. right. That's right. Mm -hmm. When you think about the enemy in the military, they try every different way yeah. or tactic to attack you. The best time they like to attack you is when when you leave, yeah, then you, when you least expect it, like say for instance, when you're going to sleep. Mm. It's important not to sleep. One thing about it, when you're when you're in a wartime situation, if one person if your buddy is going to sleep, you better be up. That's right. That's right. But better better than that, sometimes it's just best not to go to sleep at all. Mm. In the midst of a war. The enemy he likes to attack you when you least expect it. He, he likes to attack you. Uh, 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 he likes to think of ways to flank you. Mm. If he doesn't come directly to you, he will come mm -hmm. try to flank you, come to your rear. Mm -hmm. I mean, you got to visualize this thing. Mm -hmm. So you got to always be vigilant, be watchful, mm -hmm. seeking, looking out for. Because he, just like it says in, in verse 8, he's, he's roaming like a roaring lion. Yes, yes, yes. He's looking, lurking mm -hmm. for his attack. In the military, you got to always be watching. Just like we in this army of the Lord, we got to always yes, be watching. Mm -hmm. yes. mm -hmm. Don't sleep. Uh -uh. Mm -hmm. Don't sleep. Now, y'all remember that uh, song I played in the beginning? Yes. Mm -hmm. Anybody know the, know the title of my message? <laughs> Uh huh. <laughs> Stay woke. Satan's creeping. Uh, That's the title of my message today. Stay woke. Stay woke. Satan's creeping. All right. Come on now. Yes, sir. Devour. We're gonna go back to. We can go to verse nine. I want, I want you to know these definitions so you can get a better understanding of what we have to do. Verse 9 says, resist him. Resist means to stand against. Mm -hmm. That is opposed to withstand. Steadfast in the faith by your brotherhood in the world. Steadfast means stable, to be strong, mm -hmm. to be firm, immovable. Mm -hmm. You got to be steadfast in the faith. You can't waver. Mm -hmm. You got to be on God at all times, trusting and believing that God is with you. That's right. Amen. That's right. Somebody say, stay woke. Stay woke. Satan's creeping. Satan's creeping. Amen. Turn to Ephesians 6, verse 10. Through 18. Anytime you know you're in a spiritual uh, battle, you got to be prepared. Mm. Amen. We got to be ready. Are we there? Yeah. It says, finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God that you may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, 
but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this age, against spiritual hosts of wickedness in the heavenly places. We are not uh, uh, in a battle with each other. Come on. Amen. Come it's on. not Amen. flesh and blood. Amen. It's a spiritual fight, spiritual warfare. Mm -hmm. Therefore, take up the whole armor of God that you may be able to withstand in the evil day and having done all to stand. Stand, therefore, having girded your waist with truth, having put on the breastplate of righteousness, and having shod your feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Above all, taking the shield of faith with, with which you will be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked one. Mm -hmm. And take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit, which is the word of God. Praying always with all prayer and supplication mm -hmm. in the spirit without with within the spirit being watchful to this end with all perseverance and supplications for all the saints. Yes. Bear with me, I need I need glasses, but I just ain't <laughs> being disobedient, I guess. <laughs> Amen. Help me pray for me. <laughs> Amen. Now we, we definitely not need to know. That this is a spiritual warfare, and we have to have we have to be dressed for the battle. Just like in the natural, we're in the army. We got all our gear. We got all like we got our helmet. Even in the natural, we got our Kevlar. We got a um, a, a vest on, which is like the breastplate of, of righteousness. We got our web belt on. It's got our weapons, our, 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 our um, grenades, whatever we got. Everything that we need, we need to have. We need to be prepared because that enemy is lurking. It's creeping. Mm -hmm. All the time. Yeah. All the time. He's creeping. Mm -hmm. You need to get that in the spirit. It's, it's time out for you have this good season in your life. Everything is going well. Mm -hmm. So you start slacking. You don't, come you don't come to church. Come on. Oh, it's all right for me to miss a day. Mm -hmm. Oh, you don't read your word. Mm -hmm. That's when he gets you. When you least yeah, expect yeah, 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 yeah. Mm hmm that's what he creeps up on you. Amen. Amen. Y'all need to know that this 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 spiritual battle is a full time job. It's a full time job. Amen. So, people of God, now that we have established that we must stay woke, watchful, and on guard, ready to withstand, to be strong, firm, and immovable, to be dressed for spiritual warfare. Mm -hmm. Because we are 100% sure and aware that we have an adversary, the enemy, Satan the devil, mm. who is our opponent until we go home to glory. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. That's right. It, it don't stop. He don't stop. That's right. So we shouldn't stop. Yeah. You hear me? Yeah. We hear you. Come on. We hear you. It, it is ongoing. It's no time to rest. That's right. That's right. It's no time to rest. It's no time to sleep. Stay woke. Stay woke. Satan's creeping. Oh, really? Amen. Amen. We must know ahead of time. Listen, listen, y'all. We, I got to speed it up. We must know ahead of time that we have the victory and we are overcomers. Why? Because God gives us the power and authority to do so. Amen. Turn, get up. Luke, Luke 10, 19, you don't have to turn in because I got four minutes. And behold, and I was trying to give up some time. Behold, I give the, you authority to trample over on serpents yes, yes. and scorpions and, and over all the power of the enemy and nothing shall be shall by any means hurt you. That's enough to praise God right yes, there. Yes, yes, yes. Can we praise God right there? Yes. Let, me, let, me, let me read that again. Behold, I give you authority to trample on serpents and scorpions and over all the power and over all the power of the enemy and nothing shall be by any means hurt you. I mean, if you know that ahead of time, when you go into battle, what you, what you worried about? Come on, you worried about? Isaiah 54. This is another confidence booster right here. No weapon formed against you no shall prosper. Yeah. And every tongue which rises against you in judgment, you shall condemn. Yeah. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and their yeah. righteousness is from me, says the Lord. Yeah. Come on, yeah. Anybody?
Everybody yeah, got their chest out yet? Yeah. Like he, like, like, yeah. Like the enemy ain't got nothing coming? Yeah. Okay. Come on now. I'm, I'm just saying. Come on. <laughs> With all of this confidence and trust in the Lord, whatever you do, don't think one bit that the enemy, Satan, will take the day off no, or that he will give up. No, he all won't. he's doing is searching for an open door. Yes, he is. All he is doing, all he need is a crack. Yes. So don't slack. Yes, yes, yes. Don't sleep. Come on now. Stay woke. Stay woke. Stay woke. Stay woke. Beware of these areas. Our emotions, anger, depression, all this other stuff. Ooh. Our finances. Yeah. When they're lacking. Yeah. You know, that lack attack. You know, yeah. the one yeah. we're experiencing right now. Yeah. But our body is still good. Come Amen. On. Come on. Our family members that get on Jesus. our nerves. Our flesh, what we see here, and the bad company we may keep. Yeah. Sometimes you got to watch who you hang around with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These things can lead us to a place of doubt and fear. Rather than a place of destiny and purpose, yeah. a place of confidence, power, and authority. Yes. Yes. And Reverend yes. Timothy yes. once tells us, yes. for God has not given us a spirit of fear, fear, but a power and a love and of a sound mind. Yes. Yes. Turn to Romans 8. No, you're not turning. 828 says, <laughs> in conclusion, <laughs> so in conclusion, knowing all of this that we have discussed on today, embrace every trial, tribulation, and even persecution for God's sake. God will get the glory out of our lives. Yes. We know the enemy, what he does, yes. and how to overcome him. Come on. We are overcomers and we have the victory yes. over the roaring lion. Yes, yes. That yes. enemy. Yes. That devil mm. we call Hallelujah, Satan. God. Huh? Yeah. So don't sleep. Don't sleep. Stay woke. Stay woke. Because Satan's creeping. Amen. Stay woke. Stay woke.